Okay, so I'm going to address this once. Now, I've been getting a lot of obnoxious comments on my Scout is Salty video. Now, I can't really complain too much because most of the comments, people actually know what's actually going on because they saw the video from beginning to end. But there were some people who just saw what they wanted to see and it was enough to complain. And apparently they can't be bothered to read my comments when I reply. And they just see what they want to see or they just block everything out or like this one guy just purposely wanted to start a fight and it's amusing when everyone just is like oh why are you crying and it's just like i'm not i've been calm trying to approach as calmly as possible but i'm getting annoyed but that's besides the point i made a video about this already i was supposed to read the comments and then explain what the video was really about but it ended up going to an hour so i decided to make another one that was shorter and I actually got to, so I can make my point. Oh, excuse me. I just wanted to get to the point and not waste time like I did in the last one. So, people just see, that's one thing I know about the TF2 community is they see what they want to see. They, they, they just have their own opinions and just salty about it. If they don't see eye to eye, they're going to come at you. And that's something I should have remembered when I was editing the video and I saw that clip and I made it separate, thinking people would actually see what I see as a scout, who was also a cheater by the way, he was in another video, like I said. And he was being salty because he got one taunt and a crit. And one thing I know about TF2 besides the cheaters and how toxic the community is and the bots, etc., is that... If someone taunts you once, it's okay if you kill them and you taunt once back. That is fine. But the thing is, if you target them relentlessly and you just keep going and going and going with the taunts non-stop, like more than once, it's obvious that they're upset, that they're being salty about it, that they're being immature about the whole thing. I mean, in this case, the scout was a cheater, like I said, so of course he was going to take things literally, because he's just that kind of person to get toxic over the tiniest little things. He's going to get set off like a freaking bomb. <laughs> but that's not, ever, that's not the case with some of these people in the comment section of that video, that apparently I'm the toxic one, I'm the salty one, I'm quote unquote mad because he taunted back when I taunted first. But if they actually saw the whole video and got their heads out of their ass, they would know that wasn't the freaking point. But they kept going and going, and honestly, I went to a point I just wanted to disable the comment section for that video because how immature everyone was being and completely oblivious was starting to test the limits of my patience and was getting annoying. Do you have any idea how annoying it is? I wake up, I go to my computer, I go to YouTube, and I have over nine freaking notifications of people bitching about that video. It's like, did you even see the whole thing? Did you just see the first 25 seconds, saw that he, I taunted once and he taunted back and you just stopped just the bitch in the comment section? Having no idea what exactly happened next? Because if they actually did watch it, like most of the people in the comment section did, they would know what's actually going on. And it's obvious the scout was salty about it. He was mad. He went overboard. And you can tell. I mean, seriously. You know, this is one of the reasons why I just don't care for TF2 anymore. I was honestly at a point when... I was a cool player. I cared about my team. I did what I my best to participate in things. It's like it's Team Fortress 2. I gotta help out my team. But eventually, I just grew to just be more of a angry person as I played because I just got fed up with tf 2s bullshit. And it's mostly because of the people. This community is the most toxic community I have ever seen. No one can agree on anything. If your opinion is different from theirs, they will harass you for it. You can't have any opinion. I even did a video a long time ago because I was trying to get kicked on purpose because I needed for a source filmmaker thing I was doing. So I purposely talked about how Halo was superior to TF2 and it didn't take long for people to get mad. I mean, in the end, I told them what's going on and everyone was like, oh, everyone was like, okay, it's, it's fine. Like everything was cool after a while. So at least they chilled out after they found out what I was doing. But still, the, fa I'm, the fact that they 
jump the freaking shark because someone didn't like the same game and said that one game is better. It's one thing like, yeah, if someone joined the game you're playing just to complain about it and say another one is better, it's like, yeah, it's like, why don't you go play that one instead? Why are you trying to show off here? But the thing is, if, everyone, if you're going to overreact just because someone has an opinion, it's hard to respect people, like hard to respect you. And that's what this community is, but that's only 1% of the problem. Not only can you not, like, agree, like, like, if you don't agree with what they think, and they overreact, that's just one of the many problems this community has. I mean, if you have a specific name or profile picture, you're gonna get harassed for it. If you have a certain kill bind, they'll harass you for a certain weapon. If you even enjoy something, they're gonna harass you for it. I mean, do you have any idea how many? Like, I just made a name. Like, let's say right now I change my name back to Wubba Lubba Dub Dub. In Rick and Morty, I found out that's a language and translates to, I'm in terrible pain, please help me. And I figured that's exactly how I feel every time I play this stupid game. So I figured I might as well do that, because I'm pretty sure someone will at least get the reference. But instead, whenever something happened, the, the first thing they say is, you're just an angry Rick and Morty fanboy. It's like, first of all, I'm not angry. Two, I barely watched Rick, Rick and Morty. I saw like one episode with my sister on vacation once, and I see clips on YouTube, but that's just, that's just about it. So I haven't seen much to actually say if I'm a fan, real fan or not. I'm amused to an extent by some things, but hey, it's like you gotta fully sit down and actually watch more than one episode if you wanna know if you watch it, but you enjoy it, but that's besides the point. And then I had my names changed because I was trying to get clips for a JoJo reference video. And my name was obvious JoJo reference with Jotaro as the profile picture. And it's like as if they just took this, um, like a line, put it in their bind, and just put like insert insult here and it's like you're just an angry space and then fanboy then they split you're an angry jojo fan i was like i i couldn't believe what i was reading i was like really i had my name with that used to be a rick and morty reference and you call me an angry rick and morty fanboy but when i change my name that makes me an angry jojo fanboy it's like you can't express yourself or do anything about being criticized for it if someone watches anime you might as well be dead because everyone is going to want you dead if you have anything to do with furries for memes or anything i see people get attacked for it and insulted i mean i have one video and I don't know what this is about, but apparently because Angel Dust in it from Has Been Hotel is in it, that makes me a furry. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's the same guy because the posts were, the comments were the exact same. Like, there was not one thing out of place. It was exactly the same, and I'm assuming he's just copying and pasting because he's trying to shame me or something, taking the video down or whatever. I don't know what the hell he was thinking. But that's just my point. You can't enjoy anything. If it's not Team Fortress 2 and it's in quote-unquote their game, they're not going to like it. They're not going to approve and they're going to harass you for it. I just can't stand this freaking community. And honestly, I'm at the point I don't think I want anything to do with it anymore. Once I get all my clips done, I was planning on doing some TFS2 stuff now and then, but after this... I, it was already last straw. It, it, the camel's back has been broken a long time ago. But after this, I'm just reminded why I hate this game's community so much. It's because people like that. So, the th I honestly don't think I want anything to do with it anymore. I always regret making TF2 videos because like, people like that. And it's just annoying. I can care less what they say. You can say I'm mad or salty or toxic, blah, 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 all I want. But hey, if you get all those notifications of comments like that on a regular basis, it starts to get annoying. But if I'm going to get attacked for like literally a one minute video when obviously the scout is the one with the problem, and yet people are going to try to either A, point, try to make me the bad guy, insulting me for calling me the toxic one, Two, say shit on purpose to start a fight, and then when I say anything, they do anything they can to make themselves 
look like the victim. I had a guy who literally had to make a new comment just so he can insult me. Like, just so he can make some shitty comment talking bad about me, how I had to talk to someone, blah, 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 blah. And apparently, I'm not making a point, even though I told him exactly what the video was about. And it's like, what are you trying to tell? I was like, I literally made five fucking comments. If you're asking me that, you're more delusional and blind than I thought. I mean, I'm trying to make con. I don't want to be a douche. I don't want to be a guy who just literally gets set off by everything. I don't want to look like that. But... The fact that people are just, and I'm not going to be nice, I'm not holding back. If these people are going to be that completely fucking ignorant, ig, ig, ignorant, oh my, ignorance. You see, I'm so pissed, I can't even speak. If they're going to be that ignorant and have and have their heads so far up their ass like that, what, you have no hope in life. I mean, seriously, get your head out of your fucking ass and watch the whole damn video. One taunt in exchange for one taunt is... Fine, I'm putting it in, in a way that you can understand. There is no way. Actually, you know what? That might be too difficult. Let me put it in a way these guys can understand. You taunt for one taunt is okay. It no big deal. It equal. One plus one. One is one. It same. But four plus one. That's three more. 3 plus 1 equals 4. 4 is no equal to 1. 3 greater than 1. And 3 plus 1 equals 4. 4 is too many. Too many means it is greater. It is bigger than 1. Do you understand? Am I saying this in a way you can comprehend? Your brain can process? Or is your brain smaller than the fucking scout? I mean, seriously, the comments are more toxic and just... they I don't know who's worse, the scout from that video or the people in the comments section. I'm not pulling any punches anymore. I'm just gonna go all out. These people are painting the ass. Their head is so far up their ass, it goes back to their shoulders. So it's like you can hardly tell the difference. They're, the, they're inside out. Their head went so far up their ass, they just went... And their head is back where it should be. But little do you know that their head is right up their ass and then it just went inside out. But there are some people in the comments who got what was going on. So... That's on to you, and people even try to defend it. Try to defend me in the video. So respect to you, especially the pressed, the pre depressed potato. You're one of the examples. He actually tried to get the freaking point across. So my respect to you. <sighs> but to those who make those comments, shut the fuck up already. Get your thumb out of your ass. Get off whatever drugs you're on. Throw away your fucking ego. Stop worshipping TF2 so much. You... The world does not revolve around you. The scout was the one in the wrong. Did I taunt? Did I get him with a crit? Yes. Did he kill me and taunt him in exchange? Big fucking whoop. It happens all the time. It's basically TF2 law. Problem is, he obviously got mad and he went to four. And that comes easily as across as salty. Because he was. Because he was fucking mad. So do me a favor and shut the hell up. For fuck's sake, people. Now I'm getting mad. Just talking about these people. So get in your fucking head. The scout did more taunts than he should have. End the story. Now, enough with the damn comments. I had to go through and, and just delete all of them. I'm going to be honest. I deleted all those comments. The ones who made those rude and harassing comments, gone. If anyone makes those comments like that on that video, and they're obviously either being too rude or it's obvious they didn't even see the whole thing, I'm just going to get rid of it. I do not want these kind of people around on my channel. I'm not making these videos specifically for your sake. This channel was originally supposed to be just a dump. Just to give it all these clips I had. Some I went through all the clips. Some were good. And I was like, I can't delete these. 
so I made this TF2 channel. It was supposed to be literally a garbage dump. So I wasn't ex planning on like pleasing an audience. Like if it got popular, okay, that's cool. If it makes money and it's like, okay, cool, that'll just be some on the side, but really I can care less. I did not make it just so I can have to tolerate people like that. If I want, and I even have some of them telling me what to do on my channel. Saying to take it down. It's like, fuck you. It's my channel. I can do what the hell I want. And I have a hunch there's going to be a lot of people from that comment section saying, Oh, you're just mad you make this video. Look how mad he's getting. <laughs> oh, wow. He's a bigger douche than I expected. Well, guess what? Fuck you, too. I don't give a shit. I didn't make that video for your sake. I didn't make it so you can criticize me. I just took that clip so I can show like, hey, look how immature this guy is being. This is what this game pretty much is. Just... <sighs> I'm mentally exhausted with these people. And some I didn't ban or didn't block because I wanted them to see this. Sure, they won't really get the freaking message to go right across their head. I just want them to know how much of a dumbass dick they're being. Just being a douchebag. I want them to know that before I hit the good old block. So know if that you decide to post in that video and just straight up harassing me without even seeing the whole video saying the scout was the one who was innocent. For, for one, he was cheating in the first place, so of course it doesn't really matter. He was never in the right. If he did one taunt, it would have been fine. But he went overboard because the guy is a cheating asshole and he gets triggered by literally everything. So yeah, this video is getting longer than it should be. So I hope you get the fucking point. I'm not doing anything else about this subject ever again. And if you continue to harass me, you will get blocked because I am not tolerating your bullshit. I'm not having that tier 2 nonsense bullshit here. Keep it in your shitty fucking game. I don't give a shit. So anyway, whatever. Fuck you and those who either defended the video or me and were actually chilled in the comments or was actually aware of what's going on in the video. You have my respect. But to those who can't get their head out of their own ass and choked on their own pride, fuck all of you. I don't give a shit. I'm just gonna say it. Fuck you. And fuck your stupid game. And fuck its community. Your game's dead. Deal with it. There's no heavy update. That's right. I'm saying it. Fuck your game. It's dead. Deal with it. And that's all I gotta say.